Yes, sir! Oh, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK in the People's Chair, coming to you live with a uh, with a video, quick video, man. Dunks and layups, unblockable dunks and layups, man. Um, this was in my actual video, but um, in my actual attribute video, but nobody, uh, I, I don't know if that many people watched it, so give me y'all a separate video, man. Check it out. Layup package, Jamal Crawford. You're a sharpshooter. You need all the trickeration that you can get. And I'm going to show y'all some stuff with the Jamal Crawford layup. All right, so check it out. And the dunk packages. Under the basket, extra regular edition. Straight on Tomahawks. And then uh, baseline reverse off one. Some people like the baseline reverse off two. I'm saying use the baseline reverse off one because that shit hardly ever get blocked. And we ain't going to waste no time. We're going to get right into it. I'm a small forward. If a guard is down there or something like that, he jumps first. I'm dunking that shit just like that, right from under the bucket. Easy, big man dunks. And the one where he where he kind of wrap, uh, if you're under the bucket, he'll he'll wrap around the rim or whatever. That's that's one of my favorite ones. That shit don't never get blocked. So you just want to be, all right, here we go. Let me see if I can do it real quick. All right, he doing fucking layups. Stop with the layups. Stop with the fucking layups. Dunk the damn ball. All right, here we go. Under the rim. Under the rim. Here we go. So that's, that's all you want to do, man. Go straight up under the rim. Um, you don't need a whole lot more than that. And now uh, if there's a guard down there, he going to get his ass dunked on, man. I mean, it just is what it is. Uh, if you got a big man down there, you wait till he jumps. And then most of the time, if you wait till he jumps, then you can just put it in the basket like that. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Straight on Tomahawks for obvious reasons because this is the dunk in the game that I don't think nobody can block. I don't want you to do that shit. The first time I did it was on camera relative. It was fucking me up, so I had to redo the video. But, hey, whatever hand you got it in, it don't matter, man. He's going to make that dunk 90% of the time because he ain't even going to go up with it if somebody if somebody's in the way, somebody can get in the way. My dude's slow as fuck, so I can't do all the uh, super propelled baseline, I mean, the, the, the super propelled uh, tomahawk dunks or whatever, man. So, hey, it is what it is. So, hey, straight on tomahawks, man. That's what you want to use. And then the coop to grass is uh, two things you can do. You need to do the baseline reverse with the um, with your boy, with uh, Crawford. And, you know, just come off turbo, pull it toward the baseline. You do some of these reverses like that. You make them joints every time, man. Just let it go. When you get when your head gets on the other side of the rim, you let it go. And you'll make those damn near 100% damn near of the time, man. And uh, the baseline reverses. But, uh, like I said, this is why I use Crawford because people love to just jump. And with Crawford, you can always fool him. And plus, you get the nice little hop step. And then the last part of it is, is these, uh, what the fuck was that? Is these baseline reverses, man. This is the dunk that you see me do 99% of the game. If I beat somebody, let's imagine the guy's on my back. I'm dunking that shit on the other side of the rim 100% of the time because I know he can't get there. You use the rim as a blocker. And uh, you reverse that thing. Same thing with the, uh, same thing with the layup. But make sure that you're on the baseline before you do it, man. And make sure that you got the ball in the hand that's, that's closer to the baseline. If you don't have the ball in the hand close to the baseline, he's gonna do some type of some type of goofy, let me, let me show you what he gonna do. He gonna do some type of goofy ass off two foot dunk or something like that. Sometimes he'll do that. Most of the time he gonna do this shit off of two feet, man, where, where let me see if I can switch it back. There we go. Yeah, most of the time you're gonna do that dumb shit. You're gonna get that shit beat out of bounds so you know it is what it is. But anyway, those are the dunks that you need. That's the layup package that you need, man. You'll never get blocked again if you do it in the right situation. Now, don't go out there trying to dunk on the whole fucking world and tell them that Jay got me got me blocked or, or got my shit beat out of bounds. Don't do that shit. Just go in. The Crawford for the baseline, always reverse. Uh, always use the reverse layup. You'll always hit that. Straight on Tomahawks when you're going straight down the middle on fast breaks and stuff like that. And then the, uh, the basic under the basket uh, joints. And, and that's all you need, man. I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy Eight, right? AKA Fresh from the Barber Shop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! 360 out this mug. That's for sharpshooters, man. If you got another player, use whatever the hell you want. But if you're a sharpshooter and you want to dunk sometimes, don't want to get blocked, this is what's you. Peace.